What's going on, everybody? These are three CBDs that I always have on me. I always have the mangrove beard. Let me show y'all why. We go to much better. The golden tincture. You see that? This right here is the hand. This is the uh, slice of relief. Carry pain relief or any. You can carry that in the pocket. And this is the lip balm. See, I use it all the time. And I'm going to show y'all what's better. If we go to much better CBD, I'm going to show y'all why we're much better CBD. And let me talk my stuff real quick. Peace to the fam. And uh, basically, you know, I've been doing CBD for over eight years. Which, let's say over 10 years since my accident, guys, over 10 years. And I've been knowing about the uh, what's called bioavailability of CBD. And re reason why we're much better is so I can blow this up right here. Matter of fact, make me smaller so y'all can see this. You see the CBD is... God dog it. There we go. Nah, I ain't trying to do none of that. All right, you see the CBD is pharmaceutical grade. Slotted over there. It's 100% organic hemp oil. It's the highest bioavailability on the market. Bioavailability is the blood absorption. And I'm going to get into all... I ain't going to get all into that. I can talk about them. Let the doctor talk about that. It delivers maximum absorption to the body system. It's vertically integrated. I mean, it's made under one roof. And they do everything from seed to shipping. It, and it's from the Colorado Labs, guys. I'm going to show y'all. Partnered with the top biochemists with one passion to help others. Integrity packed with the exact amount of CBD that we say is on the label. And a second to none extraction process in five stages. When, uh, you know testing and third-party testing our qr code on every product so this goes through five tests to show you that it's pharmaceutical grade but it only need three tests but we go through five and i'm gonna show y'all why we're much better on the average of cbd that you're getting is five to ten percent absorbed to the bloodstream we're absorbed to a 95 and above and uh you can shop now and also if you if you're not um if you can't get it in america go to uh try the nature's feature sheets wow patches and they have the uh, cbd frequency Resonance. So this, okay, show you that the, we're the leaders in research right there. Screenshot that if it goes fast. It just shows you the stuff that we have. Researchers on the test CBD's effect on, uh, on COVID prevention. And uh, pharmaceutical grade CBD does prevent COVID. Pharmaceutical grade. I think I got that also. Let me go on and show y'all that so people are going to be like, hey, man, what do you mean? Well, we're going to watch a little bit. How much time we got? Got two minutes. Pharmaceutical grade. Stop SARS, COVT. Yep, uh, there it is. But I'm going to show y'all the, uh, boom. I like to take it into, make me smaller. Show y'all what's really going on. Boom. Let the test show you. Let the news tell y'all. But now to some COVID news that's a little more positive. And yes, we actually do have some. Once again, <laughs> it involves marijuana. Okay, which means it is time for another Wait. edition of Vice News. snazzy love it this vice news story actually comes from vice news itself on, let me see fantastic a new study suggests that cbd prevents covid infection and what? they tested it out on actual patients a team from the university of chicago and the university of louisville studied 1200 people who were prescribed oral cbd to treat seizure related conditions oral. about six percent of those patients tested positive during the study compared CBD to about nine percent of people who were not taking cbd the researchers also confirmed those results in a lab using human lung cells. Now, if this study sounds familiar, it's probably because you remember our story from last week on Oregon State University's hemp study. Scientists there found that a pair of cannabinoid acids, which are found in hemp, can block COVID from infecting human cells. Unlike the CBD study, this one was done only in a lab, not with actual patients. But the lead researchers told us that is the next step. And by the way, we do want to reiterate, he also told us this. People who are home, uh, sitting at home and they're wondering, is consuming cannabis in very common forms, including smoking it, um, give me these benefits? What's the answer? Nope. Well, definitely the benefit for Can't smoke it. preventing viral infection of cells must come from cannabinoid acids, which are heat sensitive and must not be smoked. Can't smoke Professor, it. Professor, before I ask you a follow-up question, you know that you so, just bummed out a I lot smoke of stoners. And take right? my CBD. <laughs> well, that's not my job. 
He was so kind in that moment. We really appreciate it. By the way, again, sorry for the buzzkill stoners. Uh, we hate to do it. We just had to reiterate that. Okay, here's some more good COVID news. It's but a nice change smoke. of pace on a Friday. We'll At least this is good if you live in Washington. The state just launched its website where you can order free at-home test kits. And yes, it's got a catchy little name. It's Say Yes COVID Test. Okay. We have a link to it up at KGW.com right now. Now, this is separate, we should note, from the federal government's new program that lets you order four free tests to be shipped to your home. If you live in Washington, you can now order up to five extra tests from the state. You're just flush with tests oh. at this point. Once you play... All those tests, but uh, I'm going to show y'all what's going on. And... Uh... I'll show y'all what makes ours much better that the doctor explained. Like, I could have said this, but it's so much better to hit a doctor. Here we go. I got things to do, like smoke. Come on. This is why our CBD is much better. Let me see testimonials too today. Bioavailability, baby. So five years ago, we didn't worry about bioavailability uh, because everybody was smoking uh, either hemp or they were smoking cannabis, okay? So when you think about inhalation, inhalation is a great way to get these products into your body. When you do an oral ingestible, what was really surprising to me when we were first looking into this is only about 5% of that dose that you swallow gets into your system, okay? 5%. <sighs> And so, so when you take a look at, at our products, what we've done is purposely formulated them so we have maximum bioavailability for that dosage of CBD you have on the label. And so that's the reason why we come with a sublingual tablet. And that's also the reason why in our soft gels, we've actually done a couple of uh, formulation optimizations so that our soft gels actually have a five to six fold higher bioavailability compared to Same any other competitor country. brand. So when people will take a, a product, um, and I won't, I won't name competitors, but if they take anybody else's product and they compare that to one of ours, they're gonna feel a lot better and a lot different by taking one of the, uh, the Helix brand uh, soft gels. And would you say that the most effective way right now is the sublingual to get the yes. most product into the system? So yes, however, look, when you take a look at bioavailability, there, there's uh, the maximum concentration you actually achieve in your bloodstream, okay? And then it's how long that will stay in your bloodstream. Okay. So, so the sublingual tablets are a great way to get the, the product into your body within three to five minutes. And then it will decay in terms of, of how your body will metabolize that okay. with, with respect to uh, like a three or four hour time, uh, time span. The soft gels will take, slow, will take a longer period of time to actually achieve maximum concentration, but they'll last a little bit longer, they'll last six to eight hours. And so we're providing patients a way to, to actually match their condition with what they need with respect to their, their CBD levels and, and longevity of that CBD dosage. The other thing I, that Nick just poked me in the side about was we've got a topical for pain relief. And so when you actually apply the topical for pain relief, you get maximum bioavailability right at that point where you need pain relief. And that and that lasts for, um, for a longer period of time, about three to four hours before you need to apply something else to actually achieve uh, that pain relief. Bioavailability is the word of the day. The breed and the rate at which the substance is built to the living system is made available at the site of the Feel that, guys. Much better CBD. Let's hear a testimony. Move out the way. Make me bigger. Make me smaller. Make them bigger. Let's see if it's, okay, it's recording. Hello, it's Jamar again. I'm with Miss Cheryl. This is my buddy, Miss Cheryl. I gave Miss Cheryl, I gave you the butter up, right? Compared, yes. compared to the other CBDs, sis, how does it compare? It, it doesn't, uh, it lasts longer. It lasts longer. It lasts longer, That's, and I... What he uh, just said, right? I like the way it smells, and it just, it seems like it uh, absorbs quicker. Absorbs quicker, that's the bioavailability, right? So it gets to the, it gets to the pain right. faster. Right. So you're saying a much better CBD. Yes, thank you so much, Michelle. I love you so much. But that's what we wanted to hear. We wanted, I knew because she tried a lot of CBDs before, so I gave her the butter up to see how they compared to see if there was the truth, what they said it was. I can't tell. I can't feel out of my leg. But Michelle can, and she said it works better. Thank you so much, Michelle. You have a super blessed day. You too. <laughs> Got blood pressure. Will you come here and watch the blood pressure testimony? Uh, his blood pressure was lowered in minutes. 
with just the with just the gummies. But I say get the tincture because it's so much stronger, and we don't have the gummies anymore. So you know, but the tincture is so much stronger. Here's a testimony expressing heightened. We have those at the here's the uh, full spectrum isolate. This is CBD on the brain and disorders. It it protects with things like CTE. It uh, produces more brain cells. You want to watch this video? Come to the site and check out this video. I got some amazing stuff. CBD for osteoporosis and bone disease. CBD for B a lot of folks don't know that uh, CBD actually makes the bones denser, way better than milk. And for vitamin D, v uh, CBD actually provides vitamin D more better better than milk and calcium. So uh, it's amazing. I mean, that's that's phenomenal in itself to just know that. CBD for diabetes controls blood sugar and insulin, so you don't even want to buy diabetes. You just come to the site and check it out. I just want y'all to check out some of the CBD and why I'm still eight years, ten years later, still selling CBD. And a lot of those folks that you've seen selling CBD, I knew because the CBD wasn't shit. I've been knowing because I'm a quadriplegic, guys. I'm a quadriplegic, but I'm up because of healthy eating. The mind in CBD. CBD was the only thing that I took to get back up out of a wheelchair from being paralyzed from the neck down. And uh, I had to get nano enhanced CBD, which is made with bio, with the high bioavailability, because the first brand I got was only 5 to 10%. I couldn't even use it any. I mean, I could use it, but it really didn't do anything. When I tried nano enhanced, which had 95% bioavailability, which we were talking about right here. And see, there it is right there. Bioavailability right there. I got it all right there for you. Um, screenshot that or whatever but he just told you about it right here and uh, that's why I got up I could really feel that the difference is like day and night day and night so uh, hit the link love y'all peace